Hey YouTubers, got an unboxing video here. Bought a uh, LG UP970 4K Blu-ray player on uh, on the eBay. Got a hell of a deal on it. It's amazing what kind of prices you can get these days on the eBay. So we are going to open this thing up. Eventually, um, I'll do a operational video, and I will compare it to the UP870 that I have already, um, just so you can see the differences. And if you're watching this, I put in, um, I think it's uh, UPK80, something like that, and the 90. There's a new 2018 models. Um, the 80 hasn't changed much. The 90 has Dolby Vision. So we'll possibly talk a little bit about that in the future of whether you know you really need an upgrade uh, if you were thinking about buying this bottle, this model. So let me go ahead and get it open. So I want to say I paid $55 for this 4 Blu-ray player, if you can believe that. Um, I don't remember if I paid extra for shipping. Wow, this is nice. Good job on the packing, brother. All right. So, in case you're wondering, we're recording on the Panasonic FZ80 4K camera. This uh, has 60x zoom, and if you happen to see any of my outdoor videos, um, it has an incredible picture. Indoor, it could be better, but uh, of course, if I did a better job of lighting this up, um, that's part of the problem, probably. But uh, so, let me go ahead and get this out of here. It's actually heavy. And we got some kind of packing slip here, recycle, garbage. Alright, put this stuff back in here real fast. And if you haven't had a chance, please uh, like and subscribe to the channel if you happen to uh, make similar videos. Um, let me know. Let me know you subscribed and I will subscribe back. Now, that assumes that anybody's actually watching this video this far into it. Matter of fact, if you're still watching this video, I would love if you would leave a comment at the bottom. Just say, hey, I'm still watching. I made it three minutes into the video. We have a uh, recording time only 15 minutes, unfortunately. So, this is different than the, uh, the 870. So, you see there on the front... Let's make sure we can see that. 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray disc player, and it would say UP970. Um, this has got the Wi-Fi in it, which is hence part of the reason why I wanted this model over the one I have. Uh, just so you know, I have to buy this stuff myself that I review and check out here. I have uh, most of the stuff I buy new. This one I bought used, but... Uh, the, um, I have the 870, I have a Samsung K85C, which up to this point is my best 4K player. And then I have the cheap Sanyo. Um, I did a, a video, three-way shootout of those, which uh, sadly I have not bothered to upload yet. Um, and as the new models come out, it's almost kind of pointless. All right, so we get the styrofoam out. Oh, whoops! Yeah, the remote control fell out of there. So here's the remote. Nothing super spectacular. Um, if you can even see it, it has uh, all the standard features that you would expect: uh, home buttons, play, fast forward, numeric pad, and it's not very uh, ergonomic. That's one of my complaints about the 870. I'm going to turn some more lights on. Alright. 
hopefully I'll edit that out of the video. I know people probably don't want to sit here while I'm messing around, but um, you got a back button, disc menu, uh, all the keys for up and down. This is going to be a lot more important on this one because of I'm going to be spending a lot more time on the menus, I imagine. So, huh. Before we get into this, there's an accessory manual in here. Cool. I got a 4K, uh, well, hopefully it's a 4K HDMI. Came with HDMI cable. That is amazing. And no shit, I actually got a second remote control. <laughs> if you can believe that. I guess whoever I bought this from did not realize that they put a remote control in here. Um, opening the battery thing off. This thing may not work though. Looks pretty nasty in there, like uh, one of the, the batteries took a shit. Um, no manual, cord. Pretty cool. Let me put this back in here. Move this out of the way. And then we will get down to business. At least looking at this. Alright. So. Now, I'm going to zoom in a little, folks. We've got a, a tripod here, which makes it a lot easier to do this stuff. In case you're making your own videos, I've done a lot with a, a cell phone, Samsung uh, cell phone. Um, the, uh, whatever it is, S6, S7, shoots 4K video, which is nice, you know, but um, unless you bother to do some stabilization after the fact with the editing software, it has a tendency to not look that great. So that's kind of a, uh, a negative with that method. Alright, so just like the UP870, on the left side you have the, uh, the disk drive. Um, something that's a little different between this and the new models. The LG symbol is on the right side with the 2018. 80 and 90 series and the sticker is I believe right on the front face instead of being over here but you do see on the sticker it will run Netflix and YouTube so that is pretty awesome even though I do not believe they actually play in um, 4k so that's a bummer this is a little different than the 870 they've got a uh, cover for the USB which is Honestly annoying. I don't know why they even bother. This is something the Samsung has that I just find really retarded. Eject button, play, stop, power. On the back, so here's the bonuses um, for this model over the over the 870. Dual HDMI. Um so you got one that is HDMI out to the TV and then one for audio. And in case you don't know, uh, there's probably more than one reason, but uh, the main thing you might use that for is, uh, let's say you do a sound bar, a sound bar that does not allow you to um, do the 4K pass-through, a stereo that you might have that doesn't do 4K pass-through. Uh, luckily, my... Uh, my stereo here, I've got a pretty badass stereo. That one um, does allow for the pass through, so I don't actually need the dual HDMI. Um, but so, other benefits of this are it's a smart player, and when I do the operational video, it uh, will go in and we'll talk about that. So, that is a big benefit of this compared to the 870. My 870, I probably after I do a comparison video, I'll probably put that thing up for sale. So keep an eye on it out on eBay. It's got very uh, low watch time because all the 4K players I have. But uh, other things about this, it's a uh, place Blu-ray 3D. 
and uh, features, you know, some of the, the best audio, except for uh, Dolby. does not have Dolby Vision for uh, the picture, which is the only thing that makes the uh, 90 series 2018 better. So, thanks for checking out the video. Please like, please subscribe.